Good afternoon, everybody. Because we went over the subject of the possible hindrances to your vision as a couple, we thought it would be a good thing to go over perseverance and discipline, which are very, very necessary. I'm glad you could join us. Never a dull moment when we're living together that we do want to avoid making mountains out of molehills. I get the feeling that a lot of our young people don't want to persevere just because we have these personality clashes or just because we have lifestyle problems where we have to deal with each other. Like, I'll give you a good example of that. Yesterday, I'm out hanging up the laundry. I wanted to ask you a question. Do you turn your clothes inside out on purpose before you put them into the laundry? No, there's only one thing. There is there is one item of clothing that, that does do that, though. What? And that, I do have a pair of je jeans yeah. that uh, okay, are quite yeah. tight fitting, and oh, when you when take you them take off, them off, off they, yeah. they, they peel off the wrong way around. Okay, but see, this is a, something that's gone on for years, and I've never even told you this, is that every time I hang up the laundry, there's almost everything is inside out, and I have to go, and it's wet, and sometimes it's cold outside, and I, don't, and I want to get back in because I want to work, and here I am having to do all this stuff. Uh, okay, but, well, okay, let me whoa, ask you a stupid question. I'm, I'm not, why do you do it? Why don't? Why can't you hang it up inside out? Well, I, I, I can't reconcile myself with that. This is a stupid example, but it's something for years <laughs> I've just put up with and not said a word about. <laughs> that it was an issue. It's not. And there's a point. But that's the point. It's not an issue, but it's something where I just kind of persevere and kind of, you know, bite my tongue. and. But if, if I do not know it's an issue, how do I know that it needs to be changed? Well, just like the surprise on your face. You had no idea, did you? <laughs> anyway, a lot of our young people, I feel like, do not persevere in stuff like this and, the, and then it builds and builds and builds and pretty soon the person that you're married to looks like a mix of Hitler and Genghis Khan and all sorts of disagreeable characters all rolled into one but they're not it's, so no, it's like you're going into Tesco and buying your bottle of wine oh See, if we don't talk about things mm. we don't know there's an issue no that's true but also sometimes I kind of you know suck it in and just say okay I persevere that's you I have to leave you space to express yourself you have to leave me space to express myself too that's kind of part of the give and take a little bit perseverance is something where, where um, when I was doing my accountancy exams uh -huh. I had a pile of books that big uh, I thought this is soul destroying and is it even worth yeah. doing well well, you know, the point is, is that it is worth doing. Yeah. And it is worth it that I persevere, even though you might turn your jeans inside out. Well, thanks for joining us. This was not at all planned, but sometimes those are the best ones. And don't worry, Judy and I did not have a huge Barney after this interview. Next week's video will be part three on vision and how God communicates with us in different ways. We'll be interviewing people from all walks of life. Hope you can join us. God bless and bye for now.